Alrighty, we got some Bowman baseball tonight. We're gonna try this break again. We did it uh, a couple weeks ago and it was hot garbage. I think our best card was a maybe a Cheerio Mojo. Which don't get me wrong, that's a good card, it's just not like a super rare card. We had five boxes the other day and had one numbered card in the last box. That was uh, that was it for the hits. So hopefully tonight's a little different. I spent oh probably two hours today fiddling with variation listings on eBay, and I don't know if eBay's got some issues. Or if it's my internet or what's going on or if it's my browser or what. But I cannot get the variation listings to submit. It, the, everything looks correct on them. Like I, it's just like a, a base card set. And then I list all the players that are available in the variation section. And then when I hit submit, it gives me one error, the same error every time. Something about vari variation specifics do not meet the criteria or do not match or something. So I'm going to try toying with that a little bit more. I know people do it. I see the listings all the time. Pick your player and all this other stuff, which is really cool because there's some instances where I would prefer just to hit a drop down and go find what I need, but just can't seem to figure it out. Anyways, enough rambling. We've got five boxes to bust through. We only got a couple people in here watching. Um, which is not usually normal. Uh, doo -doo -doo. If anybody is in here available to shoot me a message real quick in the chat, uh, just let me know that you can hear and see me okay. And then we will go ahead and get started. Usually by the four minute mark, there's about seven or eight people watching. So just want to make sure everything's okay with the video. Before we take off, maybe I'm just a bunch of people waiting until the morning to watch or something. All righty, thank you, LM. We're going to get started. I guess uh, a lot of people are just going to watch tomorrow, which is nothing wrong with that. I have a lot of people that that do that, so trying to make sure I didn't have any video issues there. Save our mojo packs for last. Somewhat valuable cards out of the base packs. You're never going to see any color, but some of the chrome firsts are kind of valuable. Jazz Chisholm, Jorge, Jorge Soler, Cattell Marte, a Jordan, a Jaron Duran rookie, Elsuar Garcia first for the Phillies, Marcelo Meyer, Adrian Sagasti first, chrome first of Jeremy Vargas, and there's a chrome Adley Rushman. Randy Rosarina, Matt Manning, Colton Welker, Jose Ramirez, Albert Pujols, Jonathan Clace, uh, first for Seattle, Austin Hendrick, Darren Baker, got a chrome first of Lennon Sosa, he got called up once this year, and you know, Kenzie Noel, first chrome for Cleveland. I don't know if he ended up leading the minors in home runs or not, but... I checked a couple times throughout the season. He was he was hitting some bombs. Jackson Kawar, Gavin Sheets, Juan Yepes, Miguel Cabrera, Key Brian Hayes, Jose Pastrano, Nick Gonzalez, Ali Rushman. Got a chrome first of Iribel, Iribiel Ingles for the Padres and Nick Gonzalez. Chrome for the Pirates. George Springer, 
Carlos Correa, Whit Merrifield, a Matt Reeling rookie, Shane Baz, Eduardo Lopez first, got a Chrome Elijah Tatis, and Martin Jimenez, Chrome first. Here we go. Uh, Mojo first of Dustin Harris. Got a first Robbie Martin Jr. for the Rockies. There's a Wander Rookie of the Year favorites for the Rays. Benny Montgomery, Mojo for the Rockies, and Jackson Cheerio, first Mojo. So that's a, a good way to start it without getting a hit. Take those cards. Uh, quite possibly still the most valuable Mojo from the set right there. It's either him or Ellie, I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure their values kind of go up and down each night, but it's like the stock market sometimes with sports cards. Unless you get like the ra really rare cards, and sometimes you can just kind of put your price up there, and it's either never going to sell, or you, you might create a new value for a card that way. I bought multiple cards lately where I just can't even find a, like another card like it. Or if I do find one like it, it's like somebody has it listed for an outrageous amount. Not even one of ones either, just kind of obscure cards. All right, Mojo Pack number two. Victor Labrada first for the Mariners. Fidel Montero for the Yankees. Benny Montgomery Hi-Fi Futures. Friend of the way, first mojo for Cleveland. And Ellie De La Cruz for the Reds. You know, I've seen that a couple times. Ellie and Cheerio be in the same box. I uh, did not have a hit per se in there. No auto or numbered card, but uh, Ellie and Cheerio mojos are in many cases more valuable than some of the hits you would see. So not a bad first box and not to mention the Rockies got three of the ten mojos themselves, so go Rockies. Go Rockies. I did win a lot on eBay for a hundred and thirty-five dollars the other day. It was like five or six days ago. It delivered today. Actually, it didn't deliver today. I went and dropped my stuff off at the post office, and they said, Hey, we got a package for you that we didn't take out today. I was like, No, that's not how it works. You're supposed to bring it to me. Anyways, they gave it to me, and I went and un unboxed it, and I didn't realize I, I was trying to remember what I bought in the lot. When I bought the lot, I was excited about it, but I'd forgotten in the six days it was delivered. So, opened it up. It was like a new surprise, and had a definitive... Paul Goldschmidt autograph. Um, I think there was like a Nolan Gorman auto. A couple other lesser name pitcher autos. But then the one that's kind of intriguing to me is a Trinity uh, Jordan Walker. He's like a prospect for the Cardinals, but it's a, a Trinity autograph. I didn't realize with Leaf, you don't know what the parallel is going to be until you redeem it. So it's like a mystery within a mystery. But I don't know. I redeemed it today, so it, it may be weeks before it comes in, but I'll be interested to see what the parallel is for that one. Giancarlo Stanton, Nolan Arenado, Cody Bellinger, Joey Votto, Bo Bichette, Alenin Sosa first paper, Victor Labrada first paper, Ricardo Genovez first, got a Chrome Diego Velasquez, and Jordan Lawler. The only thing that worries me about not knowing what the parallel is is I feel like if, I'm not saying Leaf does this, but if they're just telling their customers you'll get the a random parallel associated with this card, then why wouldn't they just give it to like their well-known customers that buy in like all the time to the, whether it be their products or their releases or whatever, and then just give the, the one-off guys like me whatever crappy parallel is left like the one out of 500 or whatever it may be i don't know it just seemed weird that it was a surprise but adalas garcia Otto lopez reed detmers there's an o'neill cruz rookie ronald acuna
Peyton Wilson first, Tristan Cases first, or uh, not first, just a prospect. Malcolm Nunez, got a Chrome first, so Junior Sanchez for the Marlins, and Braylon Manier, first Chrome for the Reds. Francisco Lindor, Joey Yallo, Jose Altuve, Charlie Blackman, Bobby Dahlbeck, Aurelvis Martinez, Ed Howard, Henry Davis, Chrome, Jonathan Clace, and Colton Kowser. I still didn't look up Jonathan's last name to see if I was pronouncing that right. Jaron Duran, rookie. Kyle Mueller, Spencer Strider, Shoei Otani, J.D. Martinez, Everson Ortega, Christian Hernandez, Wilman Diaz, Chrome first of Benjamin Bailey for the White Sox, Ranier Quintero, uh, Chrome first for the Cubs. Mm -hmm. There's another nice mojo. Uh, George Valera for Cleveland. Yoki Cespedes mojo for the White Sox. Henry Davis high five futures for the Pirates. Dory Lorenzo for Houston. And James Wood for the Padres. So we haven't hit a numbered card or auto yet, but we've got four of the top ten first mojos per se. In my opinion, Wood and Valera I think make the top ten there. Felix Valerio Mojo, got a backwards card. Yellow border, could be Pirates or Brewers, maybe. Pirates, Rodolfo Nolasco. Let's see what this parallel is. Uh, the Pinks, out of 199. Those are always backwards for some reason. And then we've got, not to be confused, we've got Rodolfo Castro. Rookie of the Year favorites. Two different guys here for the Pirates. Uh, these cards were turned backwards, and there's, like, a lot of debris on each card. I don't know if they were, like, grinding together in the pack or what, but it's not good. Awesome Martin Mojo and Isaac Pacheco for the Tigers. I think it's just, like, some card debris, but it doesn't look good on the front of that card. Cards are pretty easy to clean, though. Let me cut the corner on that. Try to get some of it to stick to my glove and come off there. I hate putting them in the sleeves like that, but I also don't want to like rub my finger across the card. And just like if you get uh, dirt on your car or something, you don't want to like super hardcore power wash it and just like s scrape the dirt and rocks back into your car as it flies off. If your car's like stupid dirty, they scratch it really bad. At least that's what I've been told. Not a professional power washer or nothing. But it makes sense. I mean, I guess if you got dirt and rocks on your metal panes of your car, and then you spray a power washer on it, it could scrape. All right, two boxes in. We've gotten uh, some really decent first mojos. And we've had one numbered card so far. No autographs. Autos have been hard to find lately. We get a numbered card here and there, but uh, find somebody to be nice to in order to get an autograph out of one of these boxes. Sweet talk some tops employees or something. Oh, 
Oh, Yadier Molina, Jacob DeGrom, Corey Seager, Lars Nootbaar, Brian De La Cruz, Alexander Vargas, Minium and Bailey first paper, Felix Valerio, got a chrome first of Will Wagner and Darren Baker. Jose Abreu, Mookie Betts, Asyon Kim, Fly Guerrero Jr., Joe Adele, Maximo Acosta, Junior Sanchez, Jack Sawinski. Got a chrome first of Daryl Hernandez and Cooper Kinney. Some of these guys are going to make it to the majors. I'm going to be watching some games, but wow. Completely butchered that guy's name. Aaron Ashby, Luke Williams, Ryan Valade, Luis Gill, Edward Cabrera, Ryan Mauricio, Manuel Rodriguez, Ricardo Genovez, Chrome First of Christian Roa for the Reds, and Ricardo Genovez, Chrome First for San Francisco. Let me move this paper out of the way here. Dylan Carlson, Paul Goldschmidt, Alec Baum, Ryan Mountcastle, Aaron Judge, Elijah Tatis first, Simon Lizioti, Malcolm Nunez, got a chrome Arrow Vera for the Angels, and a chrome Malcolm Nunez. So no chrome first out of that one. Yeah, there's a bug with Junior Mojo. Oh, updates coming out uh, this week, I think. It may have already actually released. It was either... I think I heard release day was either today or Friday, but I never confirmed. Got a Bobby Witt and a Julio. Nice. They'll both have rookies and update. Rookie of your favorites, Luis Gill. Reginald Preciado and Jeremy Vargas first. Oh, my stomach is growling. Another Royals mojo, Luca Tresh. First, got Trey Sweeney. High Five Futures of Elvis Martinez for the Blue Jays. Blaze Jordan Mojo and Jorbit Vivas. So again, no numbered card or auto in that one. But we got three of the... Three of some of the most exciting names in baseball here the last year or two. With Bobby and Julio and Blaze. Some of their prospect cards here. Yeah, updates uh, coming out. I think I've seen Blasters. They're, they have Max Scherzer on the front, I believe. And the pre-order I saw on eBay was like 28 bucks or something like that. Which, even with all the you know crazy good rookies, is probably still too high. Uh, I think I saw Julio's update rookie was selling between 15 and 20 bucks already, just the base. So, I mean... I guess if you did open a blaster like within the next couple days and you wanted to sell to recoup some money, you could sell a Julio if you pulled one and just about make your money back. But that's the problem. All those all those eBay listings were pre-order, which means you probably won't get it in the mail for at least three to four days and quite possibly longer than that if they don't actually have it in stock yet. So, But anyways, yeah, it should be. Should be seeing all the breaks popping up for the jumbos and the hobbies. Checklist looks really loaded. Um, there was somebody on there that surprised me that I was excited about on the checklist. I forget who it was. Somebody who wasn't in Series 2 or Chrome. I thought it was Jeremy Pena, but I'm, I'd have to go double check the checklist. There was somebody I saw their name. I was like, "Oh, dang! They're on. They're in this set." Update's always an interesting set too because um, you you have players who will have almost no other rookie card for the year. So update's like the one of the last things to come out. And these rookies, you know, they missed all these other products. Update can really be a great a great product to open in search of those rookies because. That's the only card that they'll have for the year. And there's some guys from last year who are that way too. Um, 
we opened some update megas some chrome megas from last year and there's some guys in that product who i don't remember seeing in anything else throughout the year so you know if they ever do well in the league and stuff that's the only way you're going to find the rookie cards to collect but anyways i'll probably buy some update i'll really probably buy some chrome update because uh, I, I prefer the chrome cards but some cool parallels in regular paper update. Carlos Correa with Merrifield, Matt Vierling, Shane Baz, Jackson Kawar, Tyler Soderstrom, Estevan Machado, Edgar Cuero, uh, Chrome Jordan Walker, and Simon Lizioti Chrome. Yeah, I think it was Pena, but I'm not sure. You know, all the big names have rookies in there from this year. Heck, even Stephen Kwan, I think, has got a regular rookie card in there. But um, just a bunch of cool cards. Wonder Franco, Jonathan India, Bryce Harper, Fernando, George Springer, Jeremy Vargas, Curtis Mead, Trey Sweeney. Got an Alvin Guzman Chrome first. Ronnie Mauricio Chrome. Jacob DeGrom, Corey Seager, Lars Newtbar rookie, Brian De La Cruz, Vidal Bruon, Jorga Vivas first, Reginald Preciado, Shalen Polanco, got Chrome first to Peyton Wilson for the Royals, and Luis Gonzalez, and they almost have identical swings. First for the Orioles there, just a little bit elevated on the first one. I guess if you're in the majors, you probably should have a pretty identical swing to... Everyone else, there's not too many planes of a bat that you need to use to hit a baseball. Mookie Betts, Saison Kim, Vlad Guerrero, Joe Adele, Yadier Molina, Errol Vera, Brandon Valenzuela first, Jose Rodriguez first, got a Chrome first, Junior San Quentin, Brendan Davis. Looking for some Rafaela for Boston. I feel like he's in the top five as far as the Potential for players in this set. Sedane. Jose Ramos. Justice Thompson first. Mojo. Torkelson high five futures. Another Dory Lorenzo first. And another James Wood. So not too bad on the wood there. Keep catching this corner. There we go. Another Colson Montgomery first. Mojo. Jordan Lawler, Prospect Card, Jake Berger, Rookie of the Year Favorites, Austin Martin, and Pacheco. We got a couple of uh, duplicates there with Isaac and Austin Martin. That whole, that whole uh, Mojo box had some duplicates, actually. On the first in the Prospects. Twins are a disappointment this year. Really expect a lot more out of them, especially with Correa coming up and then Luis pretty much leading the league in batting average, which I know that one player's not going to change everything, but Twins got, got some good looks, though, with Miranda and Royce Lewis, if he can ever play a full season. It looks like he could definitely be dangerous. Probably need to work on their pitching, though. All right, we got one box left. Uh, it's been kind of... Anti-eventful, I guess you'd say. Had a really good first box without even getting a hit. And we had a hit. And since then, it's just kind of been going through the motions here. I wonder if my singing is ever good enough. If YouTube would flag me for copyright and be like, this guy... That sounded just like the song. 
just shuts down the video midstream because I'm just dropping a sick beat. Albert Pujols, Jazz Chisholm, Jorge Soler, Cattell Marte, Jordan, there's a James Wood first paper, Alan Serta, Makai Backstrom, we got Chromes of Luis Matos, and Harry Ford. This is our box right here, this is our box. Come on. This is a big Chrome first while we're at it. Key Brian Hayes, Randy Rosarina, Matt Manning rookie, Colton Welker. Jose Ramirez, Dory Lorenzo, first paper, Luis Rodriguez, Justice Thompson, Chrome, Diego Cartaya, and Emmanuel Rodriguez. Couldn't even give us a Chrome first there. Come on. Shane Baz, Jackson Kawar, Gavin Sheets, Juan Yepes, Miguel Cabrera, Isaac Pacheco, Zach Veen, Jose Ramos, first. Got a Chrome, Victor Lizarraga for the Padres, Shalem Polanco for the Pirates. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Fernando Tatis Jr., George Springer, Carlos Correa with Merrifield, Matt Reerling, Zayed Salinas first. There's a Julio Prospect card. Christian Roa first. Got a chrome first of Braylon Manier and Diego Velasquez first. Braylon Manier. I don't know if I'm, I feel like I'm saying that wrong. All right, here we go. Jose Ramos, first mojo. Justice Thompson, first mojo. Yeah, nice one. Bobby Wood Jr. High five features. We pulled a blue of this one time. It was a really cool card. Logan Cerny and Diego Rincones. So we got four first mojos and a Bobby Witt. I mean, that's not horrible, but kind of floating around the mid to lower level of players there. Got a Jordan Lawler mojo. Hey, you got a blue. Got a blue. Blue auto? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. That's nice. 43 of 150, uh, George Valera. Of course, it's on card. That is sick. Let me get uh, something to lay it on real quick. Ooh, doggy. I'm not touch the auto either. We got a rookie of your favorites, Joe Ryan. Uh, warm and burnable first mojo. And Luis Rodriguez. I heard Luis had a bad year. I didn't follow him super closely, but... Alright, that's the way to do it. Cause I can feel it coming in the air. Let me get the bigger top loader here. It's like the auto top loader they call it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Not a team-colored match, but, I mean, honestly, it kind of is. I, I would think red whenever I think Cleveland, but if I was going to get a second color, because reds are out of five, so that's next to impossible. But oh, that's not bad. A little blue on dark blue there. 43 of 150. So... Well, George, I think he played pretty well. I don't think he hit as many homers as John Kenzie Noel did, but he's from Queens. He is about to be 22 years old. Uh, bats left, throws left. Number 48 on the prospect list. His on base percentage was 430 at Lake County. All right, got a cool little auto there. At least he put some effort into it. I see some autos, I'm just like, garbage. 
I do want to apologize if you've heard my stomach rumbling for the last 30 minutes. Because I know I've heard it. It's awfully quiet in here, so I bet you have too. I'm going to look up and see what that auto is worth after this. I have no, no clue. I'm sure a lot of the prospects have kind of dipped a little bit overall because the season ended uh, probably close to, what, a month ago now? You don't really get to see the guys in action, but that's still a sweet card. It doesn't really even matter, too, till he hits the league, which will probably be soon enough from what I've heard about him. Appreciate you all jumping in and watching the break. Uh, thank you to whoever commented earlier and let me know that you could hear and see me okay. Because I don't think I've ever had that uh, few of people in the break after like three or four minutes of waiting. There's only two people watching. I get a little nervous. I sometimes wrong with the video. So appreciate you chiming in there. But anyways, here we go. we got Trey Sweeney, Blaze Jordan, Aurelvis Martinez, Jorbit Vivas, George Valera, Yolkin Cespedes, Henry Davis, James Wood, Dory Lorenzo, Felix Valerio, Rodolfo Castro, Rookie of the Year favorites, Rodolfo Nolasco, uh, first out of 199 for the Pirates, Austin Martin, Isaac Pacheco, we got two more of those mojos right there, Victor Labrada, Fidel Montero, Benny Montgomery High Five Futures, Fran Aldway, Elliot De La Cruz, first mojo, there's Dustin Harris, Robbie Martin Jr., Wander Franco, Rookie of the Year favorites, Benny Montgomery and Jackson Churio first mojo. Churio and Ellie came out of the first box, so it's pretty excited to start the break that way. All right, here's the big card from the break. Uh, George Valera, blue at a 150 on-card auto. Justice Thompson, Jose Ramos, Spencer Torkelson, James Wood, Dory Lorenzo, Colson Montgomery, Jordan Lawler, Ricky the Favorites, Jake Berger, Bobby Witt Jr., Julio Rodriguez, a couple of nice ones there, Reginald Preciado, Rookie of the Year favorites, uh, Lewis Gill, Luis Gill, Jeremy Vargas, Luca Tresh, Jose Ramos, Justice Thompson, got a Bobby Witt Jr. High Five Futures, Diego Rincones, Logan Cerny, another Jordan Lawler, Luis Rodriguez, Warming Burnable First Mojo. I think he had a good year. Uh, there's one. There's a first in here for the Rockies who play really well, and I get them mixed up. I think it was him who played well this year. And a Joe Ryan, Rookie of the Year favorites. So, ended up not being too bad of a break. Got two of the best mojos and three or four of the other, like, top ten mojos from the set. Um, and then we had a nice big old auto and one other numbered card. So, definitely I've had worse breaks. Uh, I've had a couple better, but that was not too bad. Appreciate you guys jumping in. If you need something, just shoot me a message on eBay or in the Facebook group. Or I'm talking to two people. Well, I hope you guys have a good night. I appreciate you jumping in. If you guys need anything, just shoot me a message. And uh, we'll catch you later. See ya.